In today's class, let us learn about handicrafts and handlooms. First, let us have a look at the making of bamboo baskets. Basket making is a kind of craft work which uses materials like wild date palm leaves, bamboo and cane that are found in the forest. Students, all of you must have seen baskets of different sizes which are made of bamboo, isn't it? The basket making continues to be the occupation of many families, especially the Yerakula tribes even in the present day. The tradition of weaving baskets and selling them in the market is the main occupation of these tribes since many generations. Many of these tribal people are migrated to the towns and cities as the making and selling of baskets has declined in their villages. The spines of wild date palm leaves or the itha chettu is used for making the baskets. The leaves are shaven off and dried in the sun. The raw materials and the leaves are brought from the villages which are sold to the basket makers in the city. The price of the basket depends on the size. The bigger the basket, the higher the price. Students. Do you think these people make enough money by selling these baskets? It is seen that the people do not earn enough money to meet the family expenditures. In the recent few years, we have seen that there is a great depletion of forests due to the exploitation of the industries. This has a direct influence on the lives of the people who traditionally depend on the forest for their livelihoods. In addition to this, there is a decline in the demand for such kind of products as a result of which many of these people have migrated to the cities and towns in search of a livelihood. They land up living in cities and towns without even having basic amenities as they were unable to afford it. The people who migrate to the town and cities live in slums with improper amenities like improper drainage system that breed flies and mosquitoes, lack of proper drinking water and electricity. The people live in huts with improper roofs. In addition, they are also denied identification cards like ration cards, voting rights and so on. This avoids them from participating in the democratic process and availing their rights. Basket making is the primary activity of the people belonging to Yarakula tribe who live in different parts of Andhra Pradesh. The people derive their name Yarakula tribe from the traditional profession of the women of this tribe of fortune telling Yaruka Chaputa. The people of this tribe speak the Yerukula Basha. This language is a mix of words of Telugu, Tamil and Kannada languages. Students, we have seen that the bamboo baskets are produced in a simple way with the help of a few materials that are available in nature. On the other hand, there are other materials that undergo a complex production process using various tools. The cloth made of silk and cotton is examples of such items. The cloth is manufactured in the present day either in hand operated looms or power looms or in large mills. Let us see how the cloth is produced by the handloom weavers. 